Welcome back to the channel guys, glad to have you here like always. In today's video, we're going to be going over eggbound hens and what to do in a scenario like the one that I found myself at today where I walked into the aviary early morning and I found two of my hens laying on the floor and presumably right away I thought that they were eggbound and the reason behind this was because obviously both of these hands are paired up to breed for the breeding season. One of them, like the one that you see here, the Gouldian, has been set up with this male and she hasn't laid any eggs yet, but I knew she was due to lay any day now. And with the owl finch, this female was also paired up, ready to breed, and she was actually in the process of breeding. She had already laid three eggs and today she was due to lay the fourth egg. So I knew that obviously she was egg bound. Now when this happens, it is very important to act right away. And one of the main things that you want to make sure that you keep on hand for situations like this is liquid calcium and a heat bulb. These are the two main things that are going to help you save your bird if you get to them fast enough. And when I say fast enough, I mean it. The sooner that you act, the better or the higher the chances that you're going to have at making sure that you save these birds. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be starting off by giving them some liquid calcium and the best way or the easiest way to make sure that they take in this calcium is by giving it straight to the beak. So what I end up doing is that I get a syringe, I get some of that liquid calcium inside of the syringe and I put it right at their beak and drop a couple drops on their beak. Usually anywhere one to three drops is enough to make sure that they get enough of that liquid calcium inside of them so that they can pass the egg. And it is crazy, but within minutes, you're gonna notice a difference in your hen. It's something that works very quickly. So once I give them these liquid calcium, what I'm gonna do is I'll put them back inside of their cage and leave them alone. Step away from the aviary, step away from the bird room and give them some peace and quiet so that they're able to concentrate on passing those eggs. But before leaving, make sure that you put a heat bulb on the cage because the heat is something that's also gonna help them pass away that egg. Now you can see that this owl finch, she is extremely in a bad condition. As you can see, she's just sitting here in my hand and she will not fly away. This is how I know that it is something that is very serious. And it's normal sometimes for the smaller birds to be more affected by it. For example, this owl finch is more affected by being egg bound than the Gouldian finch because of its size. It's a much smaller bird and they tend to get a little bit more stressed out than the bigger birds. So let's go ahead and put her back in the cage. Let's make sure that we have this heat bulb on her so that she's able to get the help from the heat bolt to regulate her own body temperature and this is going to help her dilate a little bit better to pass that egg all right guys so it's been about 20 minutes now and i'm back inside of the aviary and as you can see the gouldian has already laid her egg so you can see this is something that works very quickly all you need is a couple drops to the beak and within 10 minutes or so, they're going to lay those eggs. But I wanted to point something out. As you can see, this Gouldian hen, she's eating her own egg. And she laid it at the bottom of the cage. This is natural. This is normal. Sometimes when these birds are egg bound, they can't make it back up to the nest. So they'll lay it on the cage floor. But as you can see, she's eating it because of her calcium deficiency. Now, normally, I would not allow her to do this. Normally, I'd take the egg away fast so that she doesn't create this habit of wanting to eat that egg. But for this video purpose, just to show you guys what would happen or a scenario that could happen at your house is if you see one of your birds eating their eggs, it's usually because they're calcium deficient. So make sure that you start to incorporate more calcium into that specific bird's diet, whether it's a calcium supplement that you add to the water or powder or eggshells or any other type of calcium that you can give to them. Now let's go over to the owl finch and let's take a look at her since she was the one that was the worst off. As you can see, she's doing much better. It's crazy how fast this thing works. She's already up from the bottom of the cage, flying around without a problem back and forth in her perch. This is why it is so important. And I know I've mentioned this before, but make sure that you have liquid calcium. Liquid calcium is something that is gonna help you have a better successful year when it comes to breeding. And not only that, it's also gonna help you save hens if you go through this scenario. Now, the reason why I went through this scenario is because for the past few days, I haven't been given calcium in the water. As you can see, this hen, like I said before, she had three eggs. She didn't lay the fourth egg in the nest, so I'm assuming that she probably ended up laying it somewhere on the bottom of the cage. So let's take a look at the bottom of the cage. It's probably in here somewhere. There it is right there. 
And that's naturally normal. Like I said before, when these hens are that badly um, egg bound to where they can't fly up, how she was just laying at the bottom of the cage, it's only normal that they're going to lay their eggs down there. As you can see, this egg broke, so it's not going to be useful for us. We're going to go ahead and throw it away and we're going to add some calcium in a small food cup so that she is able to fill up on some more calcium. Now, what I like to give them is the one that you see her here eating is Calci Mineral. And I've done a video in the past talking about some of the supplements that I like to offer the birds. And this was one of the supplements that I give during the breeding season. Now, for the past few days, I've been a little bit lazy. And this is what happens when you get lazy with certain things like this. You have to offer these supplements on a daily basis to make sure that these birds stay healthy. Because when you go a couple days without giving the liquid calcium or without giving the supplements like calcium mineral or any other type of form of calcium like eggshells or cuddle bones, you run into scenarios like this where hens that are in the process of laying or are about to start laying can become egg bound. Now, once you do notice that they become egg bound, remember just to act quick and fast so that you're able to save them. All right, guys. Well, this is going to be the end of the video. I really hope that you guys have enjoyed it. Like always, hopefully you found some useful tips here today that could probably help you save some of your hens if you run into this scenario. If you've enjoyed the video, remember to hit the like button. Consider subscribing if you haven't done so already. And like always, guys, I hope you all have a wonderful day. We will see each other in the next video.